Hey, what's up, everybody? Today we are trying Mountain Dew Liberty Brew. So Mountain Dew Liberty Brew, it is 50 flavors in one, yeah! So the 50 flavors in one is to represent every single state in the United States. So yeah, this is a limited edition drink that came out during the summertime in the United States to, yeah, obviously... Uh, celebrate the United States' independence. Uh. Mountain Dew Liberty Brew was first released on June 2nd of 2019, and it was only for a limited time, and it was discontinued by August 11th, 2019. So just a small gap of time, this was available for the first time. And then it got re-released for the next year in summer of 2020 for a limited time once again. And then after that, it kind of just went away. And Mountain Dew started releasing other Independence Day or Americana-themed drinks, such as the Bomb Pop uh, Popsicle one that came out, I think, uh, last year or the year before, something like that. And uh, yeah, but now Liberty Brew is back under a new name called Liberty Chill, which should be out in stores by June this month of 2024. Now, why the name change, I have no idea. But, yeah, Liberty Brew is going to be back under the name Liberty Chill, and there's going to be two other flavors dropping to celebrate the Independence Day of the U.S., and the two other flavors are going to be Star Spangled Splash and Mountain Dew Freedom Fusion. And each of these flavors are going to be red, white, and blue. So Liberty Chill is going to be blue. Uh, Star Spangled Splash is going to be red. And the Freedom Fusion is going to be a white, kind of foggy drink. But today we are going to be trying the Mountain Dew Liberty Brew from 2020 edition. I guess the very last time it was called Liberty Brew is uh, what we're trying. And yes, it's 50 flavors in one. Now... Is that true? I really don't know. I am curious to see if they are able to jam pack 50 flavors into one soda. So as you see on the bottle, there are bald eagles, there are cowboys, there's buffaloes, just everything that makes America, America. Oh, especially uh, we have the Statue of Liberty riding on a motorcycle. You can't get more American than that. So uh, anyways, yeah, this is a soda I have never tried in my entire life. So this is all going to be new to me. And I just want to say disclaimer. Yes, this soda is four years old now. So I'm not expecting it to be fresh by any stretch. It's probably not going to be carbonated at all. But the flavor is still going to be there. And with Liberty Chill coming out basically maybe this week or next week, I want to see if there is any kind of taste between the two. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to drink this, and when I get a hold of Liberty Chill, we'll do just like a side-by-side -side comparison. So, anyways, let's try this. Yep. Okay, it smells like a very sweet, sweet candy berry taste. It kind of smells like cotton candy in a way. It kind of smells like that Applebee's exclusive flavor, Mountain Dew uh, Berry Bash, I think it's called. But anyways, let's just try this thing. It is Mountain Dew Liberty Brew from 2020. Yeah, oh, it's actually pretty refreshing. Hmm. Well, this is very sweet. I can tell you that much. It really does taste like candy. And it has a little bit of like a berry taste, like a mixed berry, standard berry. Not one definite berry taste like a blueberry. But, yeah, it is like a mixture of a lot of things. The original Mountain Dew taste... Uh, it's possibly there, but I think since it's so flat at this point, you really can't tell. 
Um, so I'm looking at the ingredients. Um, there's not anything that is jumping out at me that makes me have any idea what is put in here as far as a flavor. But yeah, the closest thing I could say is that this is like a mixed berry flavored cotton candy type deal. It's very sweet. It's good tasting. It's refreshing as well, which is kind of confusing and odd because since it's so sweet and there is a lot of sugar in this, you're going to be thinking, oh man, this is just nothing but syrup and it's not going to refresh you, but it's actually very refreshing. Yeah. Uh, I'd have to say, even though this isn't carbonated, it's a really great tasting drink. I could pick up on the flavors still to this day after four years. And I could definitely say that this was a really, really great flavor. And I'm glad it's coming back under Liberty Chill. So I, I'm very excited to see what this tastes like fresh. And uh, yeah, it's, it's good. I definitely would say, since it is coming back, go on and pick up Liberty Chill. Um, uh, that's, I can't recommend that right away until I actually try that one. But if it's anything that tastes like this, it's a very sweet, mixed berry, and refreshing taste. So you got three things happening with that. Refreshing, sweet, and it's kind of fruity too at the same time. But it's mostly sweet and refreshing. It's like a very candy taste. So um, if, if there's anything else I could pick up within the 50 flavors that they say is in here, uh, I can't tell. I can't pick apart and count every single one. But I will say that this is a solid 9 out of 10. Liberty Brew is really good. I would definitely want to pick this up fresh. I definitely recommend this. So pick it up when you do see Liberty Chill in your grocery store or wherever, convenience store. I give it a 9 out of 10. And that is it for this cheat day review as we tried Mountain Dew Liberty Brew from 2020. Thank you guys for watching. I am DJ Glowing Ice, always wanting to remind you that it is okay to cheat every once in a while. And yeah, baby, yeah, woo, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, peace out, guys.